and then now i have to open a national newspaper a national newspaper and see this nonsense crow crow celebrates milestone birthday crow crow has written some of the most vile repulsive racist lyrics in the history of calypso crow crow is no bastion of unity of nationalism and patriotism crow crow espouses racism at the highest level crow crow is was seen in a cpep van calling people by racial epithets and then lie and say them say something to he first so he return it crow crow's calypso uh, uh, Calypso's, along with Joe Newell, have led to the demise of Calypso, where Calypso is seen as only a PNM thing. We cannot even say an African thing because PNM is not an African party. PNM suffers black people. But these clowns like Croco use race to bolster their PNM so that they could have a walk. A Croco, you remember when he was crying by Woodford Square and they had to bring Joe Newell outside by your trunk of your super saloon, your royal saloon, and you was going to sing against them and they had to give you something to keep you quiet back in 2001. You forget Croco? Cro? Cro Cro, this disgusting, ridiculous man who writes the most racist words and sings them. You have PNM celebrating that. You have Ashton Ford. Ashton Ford saying at Crow Crow's birthday and printed in a national newspaper, you know. What is this Kichari? Which which newspaper is that? Sunday Express. So I am asking the Express newspaper. You do you support the racist lyrics of Crow Crow? Do you support the racist Calypso and the attacking of East Indian and Hindus in this country by someone proffering themselves as a Calypsonian because your newspaper has promoted Crow Crow? So you are promoting the ideas of Crow Crow, the lyrics of Crow Crow, the racism of Crow Crow, the nonsense of Crow Crow, the nastiness of Crow Crow, Express newspaper, and Ashton Ford. Well, we know the PNM is of that, of course, but he just talks the truth. Ashton Ford says, former Arima Mayor Ashton Ford, in presenting an award to the veteran Calypsonian shared, when he told us he was going to sing Calypso, we laughed. He said, you all will be asking me for my autograph, says Ashton Ford. Gushing. He proved us wrong. He has done well. Singing racist lyrics, promoting division between afro begonians and indo begonians ensuring the decimation and the demise of tents that the Indian people who used to pay their money to come and hear the newspaper, the People's Calypso, turned it and transformed it into a racist attack, a bully pulpit. And the PNM, you, Ashton Ford, say Crow Crow has done well. So you, Ashton Ford, are endorsing the racist concepts and ideals of Crow Crow. This is the PNM. That's why they have to play race card. And it's the Dogla telling you that. Here, Ashton Ford. He has done well. He has made a great contribution. I feel he should be given a national award. Really? A national award for dividing the nation, for attacking East Indians, for spewing hatred? Really, PNM? And y'all vote for that? And then you all want to call other people racist. Then on top of that, the Express boasting and Crow Crow boasting that he killed what two iguana and a guti. But hunting season done since February 28, 2022. So where you get them iguana and that guti to kill for his 70th birthday that Ashton Ford and the PNM went and eat. Where they get it? Or oh, it's one law for the country and the next law for the PNM. And to the Express newspaper, I ask you, on behalf of the 309,000 supporters of the United National Congress, of all youths, all races, all ethnicities, if you promote the words, the ideals, the concepts, and the lyrics, espouse ad nauseum 
by this man called Crow Crow. If you notice, I would not even dignify his nonsense, his tutu lyrics, by reading it out here on Dogla Politics because it is sickening, it's divisive, it's nasty, it's full of hatred, and he's a total goat and a clung. And y'all are promoting him as a what? A national hero? Are y'all insane? Express newspaper? Well, if express, if that is what you're saying, that you are promoting a man who divides and attacks East Indians and Hindus and Indians in this country, well then, every Hindu, every Indian, every East Indian, and every right-thinking person who does not believe in race in this country, who believes, as Black said, if you cut me, you will see, see blood. If you believe that all of us are trained begonians, then the Express newspaper certainly cannot be your choice to read.